May I ask your name? Jane. Yeah. My name is St. John Rivers, Miss. Yeah. I am the curate of the local parish. But Mrs. Reed, I'm afraid, has not been well of late. I lodge here in the house and lend what little help I can. Sorry, her health is poor. Have you traveled far, Miss Eyre? Far? Yes. Yes, I think so. So very far. <laughs> Thank you. 
casement on a wintry night. On a day in late summer, we walked to the top of the neighboring wall. The evening grew on as we reached the summit of the rocky crag. A wild and savage place, a place of solitude, a last high refuge of silence and spirit. The world was all before them, where to choose their place of rest and providence, their guide. They hand in hand, hand, hand with wandering steps and slow, through Eden to a place solitary. <laughs> we know it well. I'm an expert at Paradise Lost. Yes, I suspected something of that sort. And you seem to be. Do you have an Eden? My Eden will be in India, Jane. Resolved to be a missionary then? Oh, quite resolved. How wonderful. To know where you belong. In the light of a virgin evening. In the veil of a twilight gloom. God has seen a man lost rewarded. He has sent me you. And I doubt is the line of apartments, and I say of the celestial sea, and the harmony of the heavens, he's proclaimed to me. Chain, we were formed for labor, not love. Chain, show your faith in the heavens above. Now I claim you in holy marriage. Marriage? Sintrin, if I am not formed for love, you talk to me of marriage. Shall I go with you to India? I must go free. That would never do. I need a friend and partner for all of my life. Someone that I will cherish till my very death. Give your heart to me, Jane, and to God. No, I would give my heart to God. It is you who do not really want it. I want you to... God wants you to be useful, Jane. <laughs> you are a teacher, an intellect, a spiritual force. Think what you can do with heart and mind fully engaged. Well, St. John, I dream of such a life. Mary me, Jane Ella. Let God and time show us the worth of our love. If it were God's will, I should marry you. I would love to do it here and now. Then pray. Pray for his guidance. He will show you the way. What can I do now, my precious Lord? Would this union be my best reward?
Lotus Hair. She ran through the house. She set it aflame. Then jumped to her death. Such a miserable shame. Thornfield was burning. We all would have died had not Mr. Rochester gone back inside. What happened to him? I'm still horrified. Poor master. God have mercy. He's still alive, but the poor man is blind. She was the first he carried from out. And Robert. Robert's all right. Everyone's all right, thanks to the master. Where is he now? We are all of us at Fern Dean. The gardener's cottage at the edge of the woods, but you'll not find him there. He'll be sitting in the garden under the stricken chestnut tree. He stays there sometimes long into the night. Dark or light, it's all one to him, poor man. Thank you.